Yo, it's your boy, me, two times in the building, Mr. Get Right to Get Left, and welcome back to another episode of Real Talk with M2X, man. Hey, bro, one day, one day, not even one day, not even a full 24 hours, like 12 hours left, probably less than that, to the new year, 2024, bro. A whole new year, man. It's a whole new year to get money, to get, to get success, to get everything you want in life, bro. And... You know, I've never really been an advocate on a new year, new me. Of course, I'm going to say it, new year, new me. But it's like, you got you got to start today. Start today right now. But we going into a new year, bro. And this is going to be my last video of 2023. So I want to talk to you about some things. First thing I want to say is I want to say thank y'all so much because we grew in so fast. Um, well, we grew so fast. Um, we still growing, but... Uh, we grew like I, I'm almost at 10k subs in less than a year, man. Less than six months, and that's that's crazy to me. Um, and I just want to say thank y'all for that. Uh, the Discord community and the Telegram community been going crazy too. I'm closing the Telegram, but the Discord is still up, so we gonna have movie nights and calls and testimonies from y'all. If y'all want, if y'all interested in that, hit me up on Discord. Um, but yeah, I also want to say like, bruh. I don't go into the new year thinking like, you know, like, all right. So a lot of people, what they do is be like, oh, it's a new year. I'm going to start tomorrow. So even if they're on a streak, like say a week streak, they're like, oh, I'm going to relapse real quick. Right. But when you do that, you're going to feel like crap going into the new year. So why even do that? You know, you're going to feel like shit anyway. But your mind, don't let your mind play tricks on you and be like, well, it's just one more time before the new year. I'll be fresh going into the new year. This your sign right now. If you think about doing that, don't do it. Because you're just going to feel like shit going into the new year. And you, sh you should feel amazing going into the new year. Like, damn, I haven't relapsed in, like, even if it's a week. You feel me? I've been doing good for myself, so I'm already feeling good. I'm going into the new year. Fresh slate. Everything. So, I want to let y'all know that. Like, don't, don't let your mind play tricks on you. And... D them New Year's resolutions and stuff, a lot of people fail them within the first 90 days, really in the first week or the first day. Like, I'm going to go to the gym or I'm not going to drink soda. Like, watch how many people are in the gym starting tomorrow, bro. I'm telling you. Everyone goes in there and then slowly by slowly, they're going to be getting knocked off and you're going to see less and less people because that's what they do every year. But you be different than that. You don't, don't sit up here and, you know, be an NPC and go with the flow and try and be like other people, bro. Do you and do what do what works best. Do what you know is going to make you a better person, man. So with the New Year's resolution, bro, like start, start right now. But even just do one resolution. Like mine is like, I don't want to watch porn ever and beat my shit ever again. You feel me? And of course, maybe sometimes you may slip up, but I don't want to do that. So at least what I'm going to do is I'm going to go for a year. Once that year is up, I'm still going to keep going, but I at least want to give myself a time frame of a year not to do that. But it's also like smoking and drinking. I haven't smoked or drank. I drank like last week when I was in Oklahoma, but that was just a little bit. And smoking, I don't really smoke. Like I haven't smoked in like three months. So like if you have a something like you're dealing with, like even another addiction, like, oh, I want to stop smoking or I want to stop taking your, um, you know, just stop, stop, stop cussing or something like that, bro. Or lustful thoughts. Well, not lustful thoughts. Well, like, trying to control your lustful thoughts, but you get what I'm saying, man. Um, stay true to that, bro. And, you know, so, so a lot of people try to do so many New Year's resolution at once, but you got to knock things off one by one. So, you know, if, if your problem is like, say, cussing, but you also have lustful thoughts well try and stop the cussing first because that's showing on the outside your thoughts are always in your head so cussing is probably easier to stop than lustful thoughts because lustful thoughts just come and you know in the bible it says once you already lust after a woman or something you already committed a sin but it's when you sit on that so say you're like damn she got a fatty and then you're just thinking the whole day and like damn she had a fatty and just like damn i would do something to her that's the sin but if you, even if you, if you just think about it and then just go on about your day and don't let it dwell, then, you know, that's not really, I want to say a sin, but it, it's not really considered sitting on it and, you know, keep thinking about it and stuff like that. You get what I mean? But yeah, man, knock the little things off right now. Like write a little checklist of like five to 10 things that you want to stop doing in 2024, not even just in 2024, 
just just to be a better person, but you're going to start it 2024. Um, and like say it's like stop cussing, stop smoking, only limit my phone to two, three hours a day. You know, simple things like that and knock it off one by one. Like, check it off, like, what you've been doing good. And, you know, don't try and fully focus on all of them at once because you're not going to, you know, you're going to, once you try, when, when you don't isolate one thing and you're all over the place, you're more likely to fail. So it's like, even with a pornography addiction, like, a lot of people have, have a better success story if they quit watching porn and still masturbate and orgasm and then you knock it down to just uh masturbating no or well not even that but it's like you know orgasming with the girl and then you knock it down and then boom you could be fully celibate or something like that so take slow steps take little stepping stones you don't got to take that big leap just take little stepping stones to get where you're at bro because nine times out of ten when you take that big leap you're more likely to fail and go back you know, but when you take stepping stones, you take your time and you can slowly work through it. But yeah, y'all, that's what I want to tell y'all. Like, you know, I'm proud of every one of y'all. You know, if you tune in this video, um, I know it's a little bit click fake, like, oh, my last video. But it's my last video of 2023. Um, yeah, man, we going up, bro. We are hitting 100K subscribers this year, bro. And I'm telling you that. I'm telling you that 100,000 subscribers. We are hitting that, bro. By end of 2024 we are at a hundred thousand subscribers and god's gonna bless me with that man but yeah bro i hope y'all doing well um tonight's gonna be a live stream uh starting at 11 30 eastern standard time so make sure y'all tune into that join the discord we be doing movie nights and all things like that and you know i've been i i can't fully help somebody but you know it's up to you to help yourself but i can guide you in certain ways but with that being said man i love y'all and stay motivated, stay blessed, stay disciplined, and stay consistent, man. And stay disciplined hard, bro, especially this year, bro. Because you can have the most motivation in the world, but the discipline is really what matters, bro. And if you lack discipline, it's going to be very hard to, you know, overcome the things that you're trying to overcome. With that being said, man, I'll catch you on the next video. Well, I'll catch you next year, man. If you, if you tune into the live tonight, I'll catch y'all tonight. With that being said, man, I love y'all, and I will catch y'all later, bro. Gang.